Happy Tuesday, Mid-Missouri. Uh, we are tracking some showers this morning, and then we're looking at more sunshine this afternoon. All in all, that leaves us a little cooler than yesterday. We are expecting temperatures right up to that 50 degree mark right around 4 o'clock in between that 3 and 6 window. Here's a look at rain. Throughout the morning hours, we're looking at some showers, maybe a few snowflakes north of about Highway 36, and then we're looking dry by noon. Uh, this rain is going to be working its way out of here, maybe just hanging on in Montgomery City around noon, but then shortly after we're looking at sunshine. We'll see partly cloudy skies through noon for folks near Columbia, but uh, back towards the west we're looking mostly sunny, and then that continues uh, to clear throughout the day, and then we're looking clear overnight. Tonight is high pressure slides in. That high pressure is going to drop those temperatures down to around freezing to start your, your Wednesday, excuse me. And uh, you'll notice a cold front just to our north. Uh, that will somewhat stall north of us. We're still looking like we're going to stay on the warm side of things, which is great if we want to reach temperatures near 60. As that stationary front kind of meanders nearby overhead, Again, we'll have some disparity in temperatures from north to south, but overall it's another mild day with a lot of folks nearing 60. And then that, uh, that warm front lifts to the north on your Thursday. That will leave us warm. We're looking at south winds pulling temperatures up into the 60s on your Thursday. Heading into Thursday night, we'll likely pick up chances for showers and maybe a few rumbles of thunder. Although, again, this is round one. This is not our chance for severe storms. If you've been following this week, you know we are tracking a chance for severe storms. In fact, this round, early Friday morning, may have some potential at derailing that chance for severe weather. That's one of the questions we're still trying to answer is, is that morning rain going to limit that severe chance? Uh, that rolls through on Friday. You can see a cold front pushing through Friday afternoon and evening. And that will interact with some, <clears throat> excuse me, instability that shows up Friday afternoon and evening. And so this is where we're watching for uh, potential for severe storms. And uh, we've been showing you the outlook for the last couple of days, and we still have that 30% chance for severe storms within 25 miles of a point. Essentially, what this means to you is that we've got a strong signal of some strong storms, and of course, um, we've got the uh, higher risk here situated currently over mid-Missouri for Friday. This does include all of mid-Missouri at the, at the moment, uh, and so what we're watching is, again, for a event to roll through Friday afternoon and or evening, timing still a little bit questionable and we're watching for that event to bring the potential for all types of severe weather. As we go forward there are some questions we have to answer. Uh, that's going to be the timing of the front where or excuse me when exactly does that roll through because that will have a big role in whether or not we actually see severe weather um, and then we're also tracking again that early round of rain. Is that going to have a lasting impact? Will that kind of kill off that severe threat as that front rolls through? And of course Placement's going to be a question mark as well. We're still four days out from this, so things will change as we get closer. So it's important to pay attention to the forecast, especially if you've got plans on Friday. This is nothing to worry about at the moment, nothing to cancel any plans over, but it's something we're watching. It's a strong signal that we could have some strong storms as we wrap up the week. Either way, it looks pretty likely that we're going to see rain. I'd say more likely than not. Rain is going to be almost a certainty in the forecast. The question is, will the rain accompany severe storms? And that's really the, the whole crux of the forecast. Saturday and Sunday, things are dry. Temperatures are warming, heading back into early next week with temperatures in the 70s as we head into Monday.